the quality okay? How many? I was gonna cast two. Uh, I missed twenty four five dollar. It's not lagging, right? I need to choose a... How do I change the thumbnail on the... On the YouTube? Video manage? You have any clue how to change the thumbnail? Barak. Right, it's uh, different. I hate this YouTube dashboard so so bad. Just the response so slow on YouTube. Like every button I click I need to wait for two seconds. Thumbnail. I will show you how to change this. No, jump quickly on my channel where I don't do anything, so I can change. Show you how to do it. We we'll go to stream, stream now. 
And then uh, there is uh, will be change thumbnail. Little icon over here. This is him. <laughs> I'm so blind. <laughs> the heck? Perfect. I'm ready. Everybody have more gold than me. Oh, my God, logo graph. Okay, performance until the end because of the buyback. I guess it's a buyback. Did cancel not stream today? Am I above 4K, 5K now? Oh, back to 5K, Barak. What did I say? What did I say? Huh? I'm just that good. Carrying my trash ass team on my shoulder. Like a boss. What the fuck is taking so much of my CPU? My computer is lagging right now. Not that much. Why my uh, CPU temperature is so high? Whoa, Lauro ahead? Did you did you see how fast I dropped from six to four K? Huh? It's fast.
No, complex. Um, waiting to cast game. <laughs> More rank back? I say five days. Five days. Like today I didn't even lose. Did I lose? I did not lose a single game. Fucking pure skill. Pure pure power. Dazzle's 25 talent. I want to know. He has an AOE grave, right? It's not too, it's not very good. Why you when your team needs an AOE gra grave? Yes, it's pretty much game over. Take a care when my shadow falls upon the fall. Oh, he doesn't have grave. Shadow wave cooldown and uh We Farmer. Hmm. Oh, Spectre's win rate. Spectre's win rate. 52. Not, not, not very high. 51 for TB. What's a uh, high... High win rate carry right now. Arc Warden? Let me see. Arc Warden. Arc Warden. 43? What? Which carry has a high win rate? Nothing has above 50 win rate. The what? Creeps in. Is the game balanced? Flood stage. Okay. Ah, but those are not popular picks. Only like CK spammers pick CK. How about Alchemist? Better living lie. through alchemy! I cannot find CK. Huh. 40, 58? <laughs> no way. I, I, I refuse to believe to CK is 58. From and Mo has 44%. Void has 51. Very beyond time. Juggernaut, 48. Miran? Look, my pet. Pray. Anti-mage. The true path. Bless seeker. Fifty-six. Your is mine. I'm still waiting for the info. I'm getting ignored. Oh, oh I got it. Change the titles. What? YouTube title cannot be one hundred character. This is not one hundred character. Is this one hundred character? Oh, McMaster! Yo, McMaster, I used to live in that city, Hamilton.
versus MacMaster Dota. I'm training for MacMaster already. Yeah, fuck University of Texas. Oh, first up. Lambo team. Welcome. Yo, you <laughs> come to my YouTube channel to twitch.tv. I mean, Twitch channel. Twitch.tv slash T Solo Top. Just waiting for the game to start. Waiting for the game to start. Perfect. Perfect. I don't know when it's gonna start, to be honest. I do not know. Okay, while we're waiting, I guess we just watch some uh, Pro Dota. Practice some. Oh, Eternal Envy. Should I watch Envy or Miracle? Let's see. Uh, 7 2. Against a Huskar. The boss game looks pretty good. Uh, let's watch Envy game first. Hola. Killing spree. But my city is not right. Kill. Trying to 
get my spectator seat this way. Dominating, I guess. Hello, this is Gabe Newell. Thanks for playing Dota 2. Double kill. Daesh putting a hurt on Mega Radiant's kill. middle tower. Ownage. Radiant's middle tower had a run-in with the Dyer. Radiant's <laughs> middle tower is not feeling the love. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. Still no right. Radiant's ancient is under attack. Could have made a pretty penny off this one. Not that I can do such called things. in the fortification. I'm no techno wizard or nothing, but I think that player just disconnected. I think this is this is fine now. Let's try again. How's how's Smash doing on YouTube? Y'all have another stream running on YouTube too. I'm I'm streaming both on YouTube and uh, Twitch. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Radiant's bottom tower no, is under attack. Radiant's no following. Radiant's bottom tower is still there, but not for long. Top tower oh yeah, Facebook. Top. How's he going doing on this? Top tower, eh? Radiant's tower bottom normal. tower must it's have been not, busy. It's not working. It's not like that. Why it's not working? I have the... Dyer's top tower is about to be Radiant's top rubble. Heroes to follow, right? This is mine. What's this? Yo, what's this edge pen? Invisibility. <laughs> How's he doing on Facebook? <sighs> Speed which camera come? How about I get it slow? It's still not smooth. Ha. Hard scar getting BKB. Meanwhile, miracles. Most pro player they get uh, the bell. It's not following. It's not following. How do I follow? I need help. I can't do anything. I don't know how to cast. I thought that because then there's no vi YouTube video. There's no YouTube video telling you how to. Dyer's uh... top tower might be going down. Coach targets. are scanning. I don't want to do like this, man. This is not good. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Come. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's putting a hurt on Radiant's middle tower. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Killing spree. Then targeting focus. Haska with a BKB. Pops ages. This Haska doesn't have BKB anymore. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Oh, no. 
Vad den säger, Morphling! Link! Miracle buyback! This move me out of mana, he's dead. Killing spree. Double kill. Is this better? Now it's way smoother, right? It's not still not very smooth. Setting for come come and pay there's a guide. Ooh, a guide. It's not right. It's not what I'm looking for. Dota 2. My waters rise. Well, Dyer's middle tower's to in trouble. Which one, Dyer again? My I guess it's click with mouth. Freddy. I'll, I'll go search after the stream. Engine Yasha. I guess it's okay. Gives more HP and there's nothing he needs to dodge. Like nothing he can dodge except the missile. The homing missile, but he's gonna get BKB. Radiant are scanning for enemies. Haska's quite behind two and six. Against the Zeus in the middle. Oh smoke from the radiant side. Oh, hero can make fine. Running into a Haskar. Hooks down from center. A veil. And he's dead. No chance to pop. He buys back into the fight. They want to take this. Oh, a good blink from the uh, Tiny. Almost kills off the. The morphling, but uh, it's close. Oh, can they kill this? Haskar a second time. Haskar oh, dies back. Down you go. Oh, let's see the fire recap. Dyer's middle tower looks to be disintegrated. One thousand four hundred got lost for this Haskar. He's done. He's not going to get any more items this game. He's just over. It's game over. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. It's proven that. Doing that glowy thing. Yeah. The IO. IO Gyrocom is still strong. I don't know what happened during the lane stage. I thought the Haskar destroys loose. I guess it's the miracle being a miracle.
Ah, the second game is two hours later, boys. Two hours later. Let's let's just play solo queue. Narcos Gaming Thanks for the host Wait, with how many people? Ah, thanks for the host anyways What the hell? The stream's over? It's over I'm gonna go to washroom and uh, come back. The university game is uh, it's in two hours. I thought it's it's in like twenty minutes. I didn't know. Begin. And you go to work for me. Go back. Double kill. There they go. It happened again. On it. A death foretold. Radiant's bottom tower has fallen. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Zip. I'm over here. Radiant's bottom tower must have been dizzy. Zap. Killing spree. Oh no. Radiant's middle tower is not feeling the love. Over here now. Oh, over here. <laughs> Top tower is about to be Radiant's top rubble. 
Radiant are scanning for enemies. All right, I'm back. Let's continue the queue. <laughs> I played the uh, Spectre only today. Spectre the Ember. Yo, I've seen a lot of SNY. But you can. I like the SNYs. What the heck? <laughs> What's anti mage doing? Oh my god. This anti mage is fuck. His item so slow. It's uh, it's. They say it's uh, two hours later. I'm queuing for solo king. Radiant's top barracks has fallen. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Might be the last look Radiant gets at their bottom barracks. Dyer's bottom tower is falling. Dyer now have mega creeps. I hope Dyer's you didn't have your eyes set on Radiant around. winning this thing. Dyer's bottom tower. Don't look good. Dyer's doing that glowy thing. There. Now the Radiant's ancient is under attack. There they go. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's bottom tower has fallen. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> AM versus AM action. I love Morph AM so much better. Except he does have both. Oh, it's already Mega? Can they win? What? The heck? Radiant structures are fortified. Dyer's middle tower is falling. Dyer's middle tower is in trouble. Which one? Where's the body?
your pick. This is where you win or lose. Uh, uh, oh my god. Okay, your pick now. You know what to do. No pressure, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Two immortal safety. Five seconds left. Oh, support? Pick support. Come on, man. Enchantress. <sighs> it's actually good. It's actually good. Now they, they cannot pick, they probably gonna pick something like PA. Morph still open. PA morph Jack. Everything else kinda sucks. Jack. How is monkey good against this axe? It's not good. Ugh, it's terrible. Your pick. This is where you win or lose. Bye. 
I'm Gabe Newell. You've just achieved That's first good. blood. Thanks and have fun. Showtime! If you're not already heading somewhere, now's the time to start. Can someone tell this monkey to fuck off? I can solo this bot. He's gonna pee. You said? So good. See you later, buddy. Good luck. Complex. I don't have the time to do it.
Fuck. I missed that creep. That bad. I'm like higher level than this Me this guy. Oh, I wish I can tip this monkey. Chosen course. Take this? Oh, no, no. Oh. 
That's my Vanguard. I got the stack. I got the stack, boy. Killing spree. You think you can fight me, bro? Oh. But they have an axe, but I don't know where axe went. Actually, no, it's meant to. Best thing about the enemy is it's Jug. Is it's gone? Reading is not that good against Jug. Hey, he's back. Why you bought him? Help you? I don't need help! I have a vanguard! Don't come bottom! Like, two man rotation for support! I was farming on the tower fine, I was getting all the CS! A lot of farm, so much experience, right? Like, look, look at my level, level nine. It's higher than all of the teams. You know, just dumb. I don't know what the fuck this axe was doing. He's running at me. Enemy <laughs> 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 
That's <laughs> gone. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? Things are up in the middle. I didn't lose any gold. And I didn't even get necro ulted. I thought I had a TP, but I didn't. That was my bad. I thought I had a TP. Ah. This will come in handy. Oh, it seems. Yeah, you take power so you can like, you know, it's very hard to invade the jungle when they have all the T1s up. Take the last. I still don't have my ring of fucking. Focus. You can't please get my items. I have this item for like fucking 10 minutes now. What the fuck? It's literally 10 minutes. I'm the fucking courier. Not 10 minutes, but like definitely more than 5 minutes. I had that before that fight. Let's go. Let me get this hurricane fight with Jesus, man. Come back here, this one. This guy doesn't have TP, TP bot. You guys want to kill him? I have OT. Come back here. Sniper like retard. What the heck is this? Dead. 
Wonder what idiot got it killed. It's not good fight, it's good to run. So shit. Yo, the enemy stack actually helped me so much. Just 
Yeah, me? What? I have a spectre? And you guys have shit fucking lane? I mean... I think Sniper against uh... Necro is decent lane for us. Necro is a very dumb hero. You can uh... Gap, close the gap. Actually, it starts a lot better when the uh, lane is shit, you know? If I had TB, I wouldn't feel as comfortable. The enemy's top barracks has fallen! Wave goodbye to the enemy's top barracks! So I can get involved in the fights a, a lot earlier than uh... Get involved in fights a lot. Of okay, oh, I'm out of mana, but I have ult. You can bait them. How did I miss my last tag?
Yo, this monkey, you know, this 20 left side talent is so good at cutting waves. So good at cutting waves. Holy shit, you like, you jump once, the wave is dead. No, you know this game, all I have to do is OT, find Axe, you know, just cancel his blink or whatever. Just not let Axe blink this, uh... Blink the sniper and we win. See, he's the only gap closer. They don't have any other gap closer for the... For the sniper. How fast was this? Bitch! This guy blame me? Uh, let me ask, before I start the game, let me ask. I mean, text and ask when the game. Oh 
some Tumblemancy. Okay, let's see if CB is really that good. Oh boy, Jug. Oh, the Jug is actually decent! And the first is bad! But Tomba Man is down! Oh, Truck Kill! Nice perspective, Lee. Bro, what'd you say? What you been telling me? I, I'm seeing CK losing the game, huh? I'm seeing the CK losing the game. <laughs> I see Jug winning. I actually like Jug. Jug is such a bo uh, lazy hero to play. It's actually you know, a very chill hero to play. Jug is a very chill hero. Oh, Blink is from Magnus! Save from Winter Wyvern! Ooh, another bad string uh Spain. But Tumba and Team C is nice! Oh Saved by Pagna! And turn raw blink out! Matamba man! What a god! You know he blink out cause he uh he was scared of axe blink. Lina Can we find anyone? Alphonse, what's up? Got the ages, blinks out. That's okay. That's a huge win for Dire Side. Matamba man with the ages! But no Phantasm for uh, 90 seconds. Dire's top shrine is under attack. The game's still looking good for the Radiant side. But this Lina and Jack cannot be jumped. Like, if any of them get jumped, they probably gonna die. It depends on how good this axe player is. The axe should finish the Crimson Guard. And Laken, this Ember with the Empower is, is pretty crazy too. Get a Battle Fury, get a Daedalus. He can do some serious damage. Oh, this jug is way. What the fuck is this farm? They are not. They are like. It's like they are not even, even in the same game. What the fuck? How is this jug so far ahead? Thirty minutes. Almost six slotted as a jug. I wonder why he get his battle period. Maybe he had a really, really good lane. 
got like 12 minutes battle favorites farm jungle also getting a lot of kills 10 and 1 Oh my tumba man The counter Oh the counter RP to counter X call X safe there's no detection for the glimmer but tumba man the ages Ooh, the stolen RP for Rubik! Oh, on top of my pack with the ages, with OT. Find one kill, can you have five more? Thanks out for Rubik. Oh, Rubik's GA to that one. What a player. What a player. Did anyone buy back? This is how Dyer's middle barracks fall. Maybe it's a tieback for Axe, and there are two supports. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. G-H-O-F-Y? I? Skill-wise? Oh, it's very hard. They're like, yep, so G H F Y. I haven't seen G-H play in a long time. Uh... They're already close, they're already close. These three like top three position four. It's just this Magnus making a dire late game super strong. Ooh, Jock. Cancel the blink. Oh no, there's no blink. It's Mag it's Magnus dead. Why even trying to save the Magnus? They're both dead! Oh, Axe call fast! Blink! Well, how many blinks in this game? I feel like everybody have a blink. Oh, Axe call fast! Blink! Well, how many blinks in this game? I feel like have a blink. Oh, he's still gonna die. Ah, uh, overstayed. Real counter, he doesn't have blink to them, man. Guy to the perfect time. Stolen! Stolen! Shockwave. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six blink dagger in this game. So Dyer has four. This Ember is not very strong without the power. Axe called a fan has an illusion. Axe is gonna die here. Looks like. Unless. Lina's thumb is way off. Can can you find more kills? Uh, there's no detection for the glimmer, but they found GH. GH. It's a rune time. Can, can they find Lina? Uh, why is alone? I don't know why. Even, why even definitely saw the Lina spell? Oh, huge army slash into three targets! Everybody's dead! This is Gabe Newell. Thanks for playing Dota 2. Double kill. And then uh, Matamama cannot get off. He cannot blink up. Impossible kill. The door. And the Wyvern wasn't even there, so he couldn't save anyway. He did save the uh, Matam Matamba man. But uh that was a huge Lina stun. Three man Lina stun into Army Slash. Battle Fairy Army Slash. Yeah, blood lasted jug. Crazy damage. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Uh, that was kind of late. And uh, he didn't even get RP off. That was a good attempt, but he got like he blinked into Lina stun. Then they all got stunned, everybody died to the jug. That was very, pretty close. Because if they get the jug kill there first, it's a different story.
This jump is way too fast. Look at his farm. 717. Let's, let's watch a little bit his first person perspective. Ooh, fast play my GH! Another pool! Oh, the stun by Lina! Uh, RP into 3 people! X call to my Tumba man! My Tumba man doesn't have a buyback! Oh, my Tumba man gets up. That's not too bad. It's one GH? Uh, it's GH. Dead. Everybody's so fast with their blinks. That's uh, some high quality Dota. I need to go poop. I don't know why. I just poop, but I still want to poop. Be right back. Dyer's bottom shrine is under attack. Dyer's bottom shrine is falling. Nothing lasts forever. This would be that sound. Back. What's going on in the game right now? I'm just gonna wait, wait for the university game. miles ahead of everyone but he's not getting any stronger that's a problem and I think
Shut up, me. Wipe them off. Back to position. What? Is it? He's playing mid, mid monkeys. Oh. A dominating performance. Net worth. 
This Morphe doesn't have anything. What happened? Dyer's middle tower looks to be disintegrated. Junior, I didn't destroy. Dyer's middle tower's in trouble. Which one, Dyer again? Rank 100 player. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Can snaking get off some big echo? I'm waiting for the game, yo. Whoa, 
Uh, poor Storm. <laughs> Storm against Monkey is really hard, eh? It's not. Radiant's top tower is under attack. Radiant's top tower ain't looking too steady. of the Rush Cup. Today we have San Jose State University versus McMaster University. And starting off with a couple of bands which are a little bit different from yesterday's game. 
but now we were yesterday carry heroes were just targeted immediately by both colleges now this game starting with enigma and tree protector right off the bat let's look looking to already take down two large lockdown heroes five Oh shit, they're casting so much better than mine. <laughs> oh shit, man. Starting like this. I know, I know. I was testing something out. Because they said they want this kind of stuff, so I just, I'll do that kind of stuff. Whatever. Hey guys, Breaky CPK here, and I'm excited to announce my new service I'm offering called Cast Me. Have you ever watched? Yo, you are joining me, Barok? We can just chill and talk about it. Would you like to help me, Barak? If we chill, like, why don't you just join me? Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the Rush Gaming Collegiate Tournament. Once again, coming at you as we got two more teams competing today here for the group stages. Once again, we are going to be seeing the University of Wisconsin Madison. We got to see them yesterday. Looked pretty good. They got a victory. Whoa, these guys are professional. What do I do, man? How do I compete with this? University. Looking forward to having some It's actually a fucking competition, but I don't know why they asked me. As always, man. it is a I'm best of one. Sucked. We are in the group stages, Radiant and I'm Ricky CPK. Going to be your caster for this matchup here in what is, again, the Rush Gaming Collegiate Tournament. So, this is, uh, you know, it debuted yesterday, and I got to say, I was intrigued, especially the first series. You know, we, we had a series later on in the day that was a little more one-sided, but... Uh, I was doing a little bit of research on uh, the Dire Side or Syracuse University. It seems like they got some Divine Ranked players in there. Possibly even Immortal. I'm not 100% sure. But uh, point is, th this should this should actually be a pretty good competition here in uh, this one and only game, of course. And the draft is well underway, as you can see. So let's get a closer look as far as what we're dealing with. That was a Silencer first pick. The Morphling Tiny Response Ancient Apparition came out. And then we had the Ogre Magi into the Axe now. So very interesting. As far as the draft has developed so far, uh, seeing the Morphling that early on, usually not a hero he would see this early on. This guy? Did he not watch the Major? The Morphling is a highly contested pick. I feel like these casters, they might cast, be cast better than me, but they're like 2k MMRs. And what the fuck is this In the draft. ancient operation but, pick? Uh, they Perhaps like their morphling, so stick into the like morph, tiny, t turblade and the uh, arc wardens. They're like very standard first pick now. Their guns, highly Ancient contested first and pick. Axe are both heroes that are most certainly good Five against said morphling. Three. Ancient apparition, specifically with the uh, ice blast if it connects, it's gonna be. I feel like I just complain 
instead of actually cast yesterday too when I, when I was casting that game I it, it turned into like me just complaining about how slow they play they miss their opportunity and stuff be very difficult for Morphling to regenerate, even shifting over to that strength, and then acts with the call. Excellent lockdown against a hero like Morphling, even if he perhaps gets a BKB, you'll still have to worry about getting locked down by him. So I like the draft so far by the university. Was no, you worry about as Mer Morph is like, what do you worry about? Is you not getting your Morph off before the car? That's all about the reaction, because the car is not like super instant, like blink echo. You you have like split second to react to the call to press your button but that's where ancient apparition comes in even you morph you're not gonna gain the hp against the ancient apparition scott the madison the response coming out but it's a strong draft also on the but these two you see this uh these are like two very very greedy support pick they have these two support offer zero control, Side of, and uh, they are uh, pretty Syracuse weak University during the landing stage. Shadow Shaman. Fourth pick, excuse me, is one that we are seeing a fair amount being uh, drafted Ten in the competitive scene recently. Uh, I will say Shadow Shaman against the Five Axe in the laning phase. If Axe chooses to do some creep pulling, uh, Shadow Shaman could potentially deal with them with the locking him down with the shackles. He will need assistance to get the kill on him. Uh, so the more fleeing meaning to help with that or tiny or whatever uh, the heroes end up being. But Axe at also should be able to get some decent pulls off if that's what he chooses to do so. Uh, Shadow Shaman not up, up there necessarily as far as support heroes that are good at dealing with them, in my opinion at least. I think Bane, Shadow Demon, uh, Dazzle even, Undying, those are ones that come to mind that can most certainly uh, deal with the Axe a lot better than others. But uh, we'll see how the... Uh, deal with him if again if he even chooses to do that or not uh, back to the fourth pick now for Madison and and she have a rich actually uh, really good with uh choose quickly Ooh, they go with the chaos, chaos night. Night. interesting mm, as far as chaos is concerned trying to think the reason for it uh, tiny very low armor at least early on I don't necessarily know if they're gonna be matched up against the tiny in the laning phase though so I don't know if that's necessarily the reason that they would they would pick up said hero. Um, morphling as far as morphing into Chaos Knight, I suppose that that could be interesting for him, using both that Reality Rift and the Chaos Bolt. So, yeah, I, I'm not uh, really too sure on the CK pick, other than a lot of the. U I really wish I have a co-caster. I, I'm not good at just talking by myself. Actual cores are banned out. They ban Terra Blade and Phantom Lancer themselves. Arc Warden banned on the other side. You have the Morphling pick already. So we, we are starting to get to the next tier, of course, to be fair. Uh, not that CK is a bad I one. I think the game starts at, uh, at a 7 p.m. But, uh, one that you can make work, certainly, especially with a uh, good Phantasm procs and that extra illusion or, you know, just in general RNG with the hero, of course, with his passive. I'm blanking on the name right now. I want to say Chaotic Strike, if I'm not mistaken, but... Uh, Right now, this uh, yeah, Dire team doesn't we'll have any sure. crowd, uh, go like the the crowd control pick. for the CK, as far as except Tiny, goes, but it's not enough, you need more. In the off lane and all these heroes, they so get uh, pulled by the CK, University. they just die. <coughs> I think Tiny matches up just they don't have any Kunko. savings, have too. The safe lane, so I, I would guess perhaps they're off lane. No, I'm not. They told me to watch um, this. Like how hero uh, even would it be bad so option here? Like they don't really guy. got them with the ogre and the shadow shaman. So if Kunkka oh, X's somebody, it's, it's going to be difficult. Also, these cores currently not really a yields a standout. Yeah, you to match up against Kunkka. Instead, coming out from them. So, but I don't. I didn't even know if people were hearing me in, Reserve in game. We only have so much longer. Twenty seconds, really, before they do need to figure out which direction they are going to go in. Drow Ranger, Whoa. choose your hero. I predict Dyer win the game. I mean Radiance. Has to be Radiance winning, right? Finish that before they push again. Look at Snow though. He's got the Wait, they got ratted? Or what? How did they lose that rack? 
Yeah, but in the end, it's a Radiance victory. It's so obvious, like this patch right now, you cannot lose on the draft this hard. Yeah, I know, I know, I'll stream early, I'll show, I will try to analyze the new, new meta. The patch. This, this dire lineup, there's no way they can win. With a simi similar skill range, like, they don't have the stronger lane, they don't have the stronger team fight, they cannot deal with this, uh, CK and uh, like early to mid game, this uh, morph would just die to the die to the uh, ancient operation OT. It's a pretty bad draft. I blame their captain. <laughs> okay, okay. Let me let me it just watch his uh, intro again. Look, it doesn't lag. It means he has a, maybe he has a soundboard, so he can control the music there. If I tap out the game and then to like turn down my music, the game will lag. Team back, radiant team back. All right, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the Rush Gaming Collegiate Tournament. Once again, coming at you as we got two more teams competing today here for the group stages. Once again, we are going to be seeing the University of Wisconsin Madison. We got to see. Hmm. So what's my teams again? University of Austin. University of Texas at Austin. And the McMaster. Uh, I was gonna go to McMaster, you know, Barrock. I was gonna go to McMaster. Uh, mistakes were made. I should have stayed in Hamilton. Just go to the McMaster. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. Now I need to see how he moves his camera. Morphling is the biggest thing that's standing out, of course. He tries to morph into Kanka and use it against him, but obviously ended up missing the combination when you're trying to click someone. But how does, he, two how does he do this? He was at once, essentially. It's a little harder to do, to be fair, but good attempt from the Morphling. Ogre's wrapping around, however, and he uses that tour once again. How did he do that? Like move camera like this. Oh. Oh. I, sh I shouldn't show this. Okay. Okay. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> and now this time, Kunkka. He is going to go down. Morphling has a last laugh in the end, despite the failure initially. No, it's a, it's not a university, it's a city. Ogre, top lane it's, Ogre, he's it's dead. Just, Battle Hunger uh, and Narcan Chris. This is what I was here. talking about. That's going to be so annoying. And there is nothing to do. And, uh, there, to deal with. This, and right now, this, this is the capital of my though, province, but there's nothing three here. Hero kills in favor of the Rady, but look at the CS across the board. Chaos Knight, Axe, and There's nothing here. Punko, nothing to do, nowhere to go. I no really good restaurant. Axe missed out on an opportunity here to pull creep waves. Rasta Drow is. How how do they move the camera like this? I don't know how to move be, the camera. Uh, able like to this. stop you. I mean, I guess the frost arrow, the shackles would be really annoying, but you would also be annoying them in the meantime. And you do have that silencer backup support, so it seems like that might have been the more efficient play for CS farm at least. But how do they move their camera like? This? I need to ask her. Ah, arrow 
okay, 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 got it. Got it. And let me just try it in game. Maybe I should move my camera. Bet. Bet. The little little. Where's my camera? Where did I move it? And how do I lock the hero? Let me just try it. Uh, Matamba by Morph. The game is starting soon. I would like switch scene like two minutes. Oh yeah. But it's so fast. I need to slow it down, I think. Uh, where is the sensitivity? Oh, camera speed? Like this. Still fast. Dyer are scanning. Try to find those sneaky bums. Godlike. How about now? Still feels very Maybe fast. This top tower ain't looking too steady. Radiant structures are fortified. Illusion. Radiant's top towers about to topple. Radiant's top towers under attack. Radiant's top tower is under attack. Dice putting up a barricade. Radiant's top tower is about to top. Radiant's top tower has fallen. Dyer's middle tower looks to be disintegrating. How do I hold him? Killing spree. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. <laughs> My thanks to thee. Radiant's middle tower had a run in with the dire. 
Radiant's middle tower is not feeling the love. What's that? What did I choose? Left click to toggle. What's it? Dyer's Boom. Dyer's heard on Radiant's middle tower. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Radiant called in the fortification. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower is about to be Radiant's top rubble. The fuck is camera Radiant's grief? Middle I don't tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. But Tom and just lost two games to the same Radiant's guy. Radiant's middle barracks has fallen. This <laughs> Radiant's middle barracks. Twenty-four has minutes. Hits. Oh, uh, is this a mid anti man? No. <laughs> he just skipped the man uh battle fury. Because they have a uh, Magnus in power. Yes. Wow. Tis mine. You feel so I think the it's just for a little bit control, cause the fuel so is fat. Uh, it's cheap, cheaper than Scotty, cheaper than uh, Abyssal. And I think the mana break st uh, stacks right. We can test it. Why can I demo this guy? Is the game breaking? Uh, maybe Radiant let me restart the game enemies. just to be safe. Let's try see if it's that. It's, I go. It's not that great. Oh my god. Mm. Fortune and glory await. As thou will it. So that's the one. Burns uh about thirty. And uh, let's get a diffuser blade. No down axe. It is a blessing. Oh, it doesn't stack. I think it's just the path is clear. Can I switch scene? I'm gonna prepare for a little bit.
Everybody's in lobby now, just waiting for the game to start. Lemonade was a popular drink and it still is. I get more props and stunts than Bruce Willis.
Okay, hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome to the Rush Cup. Today we have a uh, University of Texas in Austin against going against McMaster University. Let's see the pick and ban. It's Radiant's University of now. Austin, Texas ban uh, Centaur. It's a center and X first and second band. Very standard. If you watch the the last major, the, the both are like high cont contested picks. It's Dyer's band now. Necromancer's the second pick. It's it's not so popular, but maybe like they did their homework. Is there uh, one of the McMaster players comfort pick, maybe? Necro doesn't really counter as any hero in lane. It's a really low mobility hero. Ten seconds. It was good. Uh, Five seconds left. Like two weeks uh, earlier this season because no, no, people didn't know how to deal with him. Now everybody knows how to deal with him, so it's not really a highly contested pick anymore. Radiant's turn to ban. A shaker pick. None of the uh, team banded any carry picks yet. All the carry picks are still open. Something like Arc Warden, PLTB, Spectre, Morphling. 10 seconds. Five seconds left. This last ban is important. They might want to pay, uh, ban one of the meta carry right now. Now all those meta carries sort of counters each other. He counters TB. Because uh, he has many ways and uh, he has ways to purge off the reflection. That's what what make TB so strong against other carries. Is uh is re reflection. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Interwiving. I don't know any of these players, but uh, I do know this Lucky Lucky guy might be a offlaner. That's all I know about these two teams. Like Master taking their time for their last last ban. They only have thirty seconds. They're using a lot of time. Radiant's turn to pick. They only have twenty thirty seconds reserve time left. Terrorblade. Dyer's turn to pick. Radiant's pick Tiny. Tiny right now can uh, can fit any position. He can be position two, three, four, five. Depends on where you want him to be. Dyer it's a, pick. It's a nice first pick. You don't give away too much info by picking Tiny. Bench. You don't really see him that often because there are like better picks for the support role. Morphling, PL, and uh, Arcwood is still open. They are like very highly contested picks. Five seconds left. Radiant pick. The McMastering have a very good, very nice flag. Look, this flag they got there. They definitely put a lot of work into making this flag. It's Radiant's pick now. Oh, God, my joy. Both teams still not giving away too much info about their uh, lineup. Dyer's 
Ogre can play. also be a position 3. Position 3, 4, 5, but um, most of the time he's position 5. He's a very powerful hero if you, you can get a farm on him. He doesn't have play. a good way to get farm. PL is banded by the Radiance and Invoker. It's Dyer's band Spectre. now. Dyer might ban the Morphling here, or they can they can save it for themselves. It's it's all the Dyer's OP carries are banned. I think Morphling is a really really good pick here. They can even pick up Doranger with Morphling. Just make that morph that much stronger. Ten seconds. Five seconds left. McMaster University only have fifteen seconds. Reserve time left. They really need to make up their mind. If they don't pick the morph here, I think uh, Radiant is just gonna take it. Two seconds. Radiant pick. It's a Juggernaut pick. That's a hero you don't see that often. Because the laning phase is. If he gets behind you in the laning phase, uh, he's a very weak hero. Once he gets behind on level. Ten seconds. Five seconds left. And if he lands into this tiny land, tiny can always have the option to uh, toss the jug away. If jug wants to go for the kill with the spin. Bang, one of the strongest uh, support. They have two very strong support right now. But so is Undying. Ooh, this is Abaddon. They have a lot of re heals. Ten seconds. On the Dire Squad. All these three heroes have heals. Five seconds left. And the uh, Abaddon can purge off the spirit, uh, spirit vessel, which is the best way to deal with the massive heal composition. Dyer's turn to ban. Mirana. Mirana. This this look like a mid Mirana pick. The morphing is still open. It's been proven how strong the hero is. It's Radiance uh, ban now. The Monkey King ban. The Dire lineup lacking a little bit of control. They only have the Venge stun. Both teams don't have... Uh, the Radiant has a little better control. 10 than, uh, seconds. They don't have the huge team fight hero yet. Five seconds for both left. team. Let's see what they want to ban. For the turn mid hero, it's Arc Warden ban. Arc Warden can fit pretty well with the Dire lineup if they want to go Siege. They have the Healing Ward, they have uh, Abaddon Shield, they have Tombstone, it's, they have a very uh, strong Siege lineup. Ten seconds. I really think Morphling is a good pick here. 
for the Radiant. Cause, uh, with the Morphling OT, you can turn into Undying for the Tombstone. You can turn you into Abaddon for the Shield. And passive back. if you can get the uh, TA. I think they're just picking their comfort hero. It's not too much of the meta here. Whoa. This is a dirty last pick. TA actually. Uh, Viper has a very good lane against TA. All right. Seem like everybody's ready. Just looking at the lineup, I favor the McMaster lineup a lot. And I also think they have better players. Standard laning, tiny and ogre top lane. It's a carry Mirana. At the bottom they have the classic sleep into arrow combo, but with the dual lane, like you can always uh, wake uh, your teammates up. Especially with Abaddon, you can just shield the teammate, and break the nightmare. It's not that easy to do the combo. Juggernaut with a Corning Blade. You don't see uh, carries by Corning Blade that early because it's a uh, you need a lot of regen for the dual lane. Thirty seconds to showtime. This Jug doesn't have any mana regen. They they want to swap lane. Or uh, it's a dire smoke. Did they see? They didn't see, but uh, looks like a lane swap. And now Both him getting two rooms. They don't want to, the Dire King doesn't want to put the, the Jug against uh, Tiny. And it's a Twilight looks like. Mm. And I just start getting his DK style right away. Not many support can trade right click with Undying. Oh, never mind. Undying keep his top. This the Abaddon looks like he needs some help. Ogre gets out. Uh, get, got the stun level one. Cause Undying can. Uh, the Abaddon can purge off the ignite with uh with the shield. Let's look at the mid lane. Some say like a skilled TA can win this matchup, but most of the time, uh, Viper can force TA out of the lane, force TA into the jungle. CS wise, Viper is a little bit ahead. They both not get not getting that much CS. The only problem about Viper is his uh, low attack damage early game. Do they both have enough regen? Viper still have a cell. TA is out of region. He has 
tangles, but he should get the stealth soon. Bottom lane. Jack is getting a, his RCS in this uh, Mirana by a lot. Oh, sleep. That's what I was talking about. You can wait, always wake your teammates up. But Jack overstays. He he went back. Can he survive? There's another leap charge on the Miranda. Is that first blood? Face, That's first blood. First blood. On the Miranda. But it's, it's not really not that bad because uh, Miranda has a huge cooldown on her leap. She just used like all three of her leaves. Yeah. <laughs> Back to the bottom lane. Viper got the uh, illusion should help him CS a bit. Oh top bottom lane. Oh top. <laughs> They traded one uh one for one. I'm dying for the tiny. It's a little bit favoring the uh, no direct right. team right now. Once this Abaddon gets some level, it's uh it's gonna be a really really hard lane for the radiant team. I'm really curious when they're gonna start grouping because on that uh, the Abaddon is not that strong by himself. There's two ways you can go with Abaddon farm for that Radiant, become a one f like a semi carry, or you can just get some team fight item, join your team, and push with the Juggernaut Healing Ward. I think they should push a little bit early before TA gets two three items. Ben denies the uh, room. I think that was the arcing room from the Viper. Top lane. Another attempt, but a man gets tombstone down, gets taken down. Tiny dies to the. The, the shield explosion from dying. I mean, I have a tongue. CS wise mid lane is still very even between these two. TA missed her stacks. <laughs> the arrow onto the spinning jug didn't hit anything. This TA is running low on mana. Level 5 Viper is really starting to bully this TA. Force the TP from the Ogre Magi, but Ogre needs to be careful that Viper can just turn around and kill him. Hey, that's uh, the Viper was playing really scared for whatever reason, but I think definitely think he can just turn and kill the Ogre there. Oh, another support rotation, the Bane catches the. Ventral Spirit stun TP, can he make it? Nope. Ventral's trying to ward, I think. Did he have a ward? He did, didn't have a ward. He wanted to gank the TA instead get uh, spotted by the Bane. Mid lane. This TA doesn't have any spells. Forces the TP, can he make it? Very, very close. The Viper so ran out of mana for the orb, for the poison orb. Oh no! Night. That was close. Didn't have the mana for the last hit. Bottom lane sleeping to the arrow, but support on that in TPC. Was that on Daniel Bench? Bench was spirit TPC. Jax has a spin. With the vent was an easy kill. Also tank the arrow. Mid lane. 
This is very important when you play against uh, TA. You always need a sentry. Doesn't matter what hero you are. Uh, but this viper is just overstaying. Choose so. a poor rotation. It's really bad for the viper player. So you're, you're supposed to dominate the lane. Now you cannot fall back into jungle as a viper right now. He ah! can always uh, farm the jungle and uh, farm ancient stack to catch up, get a lot of farm, get back to, into the game. But the uh, viper doesn't really have the same option. Ooh, another bane slip into the arrow. Ah, uh, she, they don't want to go for it. Miranda was low on mana. She only has one spell. No, not enough mana for the top lane. Avan's level five, but with the helm of Dominator, I'm dying. TBC with the tombstone. Oh, the magic TBC out. They know they can find this. <laughs> Trespasser. Bottom lane, they found a jug. I assume that was a slip into the arrow combo. Tower is under attack. Can't, can't get off his uh, spin. Still better trade for uh, Radiant. Surprisingly, they're, uh, they're having a lead. Despite having like unfavorable matchup, this Abaddon ha already has his helm of dominator. Ooh, somewhere else, somewhere. The jug dies again. To the same combo. What? What in the hell? That's that's not supposed to happen. That's unacceptable. Did he get just get arrowed or sleep into an arrow? I'm confused. Cause you, the sleep has very short cast range. There's no way he just walks up to the jug and sleeps him. Dyer's bottom tower is getting pushed around. Shadows. Oh, moonlight shadow. Can they get any kills? The Dyer do have a sentry on the high ground. Just so Moonlight Shadow for the uh, room. Pretty successful. Death tax. A top lane going on the Abana, but Abana has an OT and another shield. Can it turn into a run? They do have a tombstone, level 1 tombstone. Now Dice is maxing his heal. I don't I don't agree with this at all. Now he's gonna die here too. He has two points in the soul reef. Ooh, but he gets off, gets a return kill on Ogre Mike. Not too bad. Uh, but the Helm of Dominator creep died to the Miran arrow. It's actually one of the counter to the Helm of Dominator. One of the hardest counter. So always get that, that plus 200 go free mid lane. Jack rotates mid and kills off the. Get the Templar assassin. That's a nice kill. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. It's Mirana is ahead of everybody on the network chart, but uh, Radiant's middle tower that, is not feeling You have to be ahead when you're playing a Mirana. If you play Mirana from behind, you're probably gonna lose. But what what just happened? Three of the radiant heroes died for no reason. Overstay top. This Abaddon is very strong right now. Level eight with Helm of Dominator, pushing the tower with a uh, catapult. Radiant's Helm of Dominator catapult. <laughs> Bottom lane. Viper is going for uh, Maelstrom. Pretty standard build. 
Tiny is very far away from the Blink Dagger right now. It's on dying is maxing so rip. But the problem of maxing so rip is that you don't always have enough rubble. units for you to like suck HP from. Max Soul Rift is 16, but uh, look at the lane. There's not enough creeps. Mid lane, Ogre Magic rising to the. Uh, they both don't have any control. They just gonna walk away from each other. That was a dire smoke, too. This Jug is just not having a good game. Walk past the TA trap and this broke the smoke from the ogre. TA is going for blink first. It's a risky build. You go Dazzle first, you can always get a blink in like three, four minutes. You just farm that fast. The mist, the dust on the tiny. Good. Other name. We're gonna defend. Viper TVs into two hero, but Mira miss misses the arrow. Doesn't, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Still dies anyway. That was a very bossy TP. Maybe you didn't see the Moonlight Shadow. Oh, they want to go for the Abaddon too. Is there that another leap? One more leap on the Mirada. They they overstanded themselves. Just too deep. Miranda gave away, gave away her, her life. No TA is hiding in the tree. Yeah, I'm not a good, good caster. Yay. Yeah. Uh, Radiant's bottom tower is still there. But not for long. Uh, you gotta lose the uh, bottom Q1 for that play. That was definitely always then. The T didn't have any item. She's still hiding here. What the heck? Dyer's top tower Waiting for the T to come down. Oh, are they gonna turn? He's so. He's creep onto the Abaddon. Very questionable place. Abaddon is purchased off with his own. Tombstone down. And the Meridian team still running in. Look at the ogre. And the ogre gonna die here. Oh, looks like everybody's dead. And TA2! That's a 4 4 0! Radiant's bottom tower must have been dizzy. Uh, I think there's like rank 20 players. They told me uh, this Abaddon is a rank rank 20 player. He's going for the Radiance build. I think that's the correct choice. The the Radiant team didn't stack Ancient at all when they have a TA. It's some kind of 2K place. And they, they had TA last pick. They should know how to play TA, but they didn't stack any jungle for the TA. Not P TA 16 minutes. Doesn't have any item. I was on top of the network. Invisibility. Out of my way. Oh, we run the arrow for the catapult. Bloodlust the tower. I think that I can just push here. I, there's nothing to stop them. Chuck died on the side. To tiny plane class uh, ogre stun. 
Oh, Tombstone down, they cannot fight into this. They just have to run away. Sacrifice a support for uh, position one. I, I take it. But Avanon's still going. He doesn't have the radiance just yet, but uh, very close. Mm, this job has some uh, very questionable place. 17 minutes, only have a Yasha. Dyer's middle tower's in trouble. Which one, Dyer again? The Mirana is farming okay, but this TA is six on the network. This TA has less gold than the job. It's all because they just... I don't understand why they just didn't stack any jungle camp for the TA. Why you have a TA? You just uh, stack the ancient camp. That's how TA farms so fast. Yeah, tip the TA. Okay, so... Nice toss back on the jug. Jug still has the omni slash, but didn't use it. Didn't have the mana, but he had the stick charge. What? Didn't pop the stick for the OT. He just dies. Mm, TA now is just fine. Looking for any farm she, she can find. Now she TA cannot. You, she cannot even farm in the stack. Cause they lost all their T1 towers and T2 bottom. They lost all control of their jungle. They cannot go past this point. But I think this Abaddon is gonna like one versus five soon. I don't think any Radiant Hero is strong enough to take take on this Abaddon right now. And this Abaddon is gonna farm a lot faster after the Radiance. A lot of sentry from the radiant side for the D Wardian TA trap. Ah, uh, not TA traps, but like. Yeah, At least they gain the control of their jungle back. Top under attack. Of a uh, top lane. It's another T2 tower for Dire. Dire Doesn't look Dyer like Radiant's Dyer's gonna do it. Top tower has fallen. Dire can even take the Roche right now. With healing ward. Abaddon Bottom lane <laughs> Radiant finds Viper They don't have anything to cancel the TB That's a downside of the dire lineup They only have Venge to cancel the TB If Venge is not there, nobody can cancel TP. Venge had the TP but didn't use it <laughs> TA is catching up this Jug's really ha struggling to farm. And Tia should just put down her traps in the lane. So she can cut the way. Oh, we didn't find another pickoff with a tiny dagger. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Uh, this jug. This was the last of my kind. Okay. <laughs> they also don't have anything to cancel the bang grief. Dyer's top tower is they under need bang swap or uh, stun. It's pretty hard to do. Dyer's top tower is under attack. But this Abaddon still being a beast. Dyer's structures. Nothing can stop him. 
Dominating performance. Tiny jump scene and she's gonna die too. Just die to the raw damage Hello, of the dark this team. Is Gabe Newell. Thanks for playing Dota 2. Double kill. What the hell is going on? I'm confused. The Radiant team made some good plays to uh, get some good got some good catch to but like, all of a sudden, they, tower has the die is knocking on that high ground. Nobody can take down this Abaddon. It's, it's just Radiant's way too fast. Tower is under this TA doesn't have any item yet. Blink straight into BKB. I don't think that's enough. Perfect. Sleep arrow combo onto the Abaddon. It doesn't do anything. Abaddon still has his ulti. He's going to get his next item very soon. Is Dara going to do the Roche? They don't have a sentry down. There, there is a tier trap. The tier has a blink. They have double blink on the Dara side. Are they gonna smoke? Stop the... Looks like they're gonna... They're not gonna let this Roche go for free. Can they get here fast enough? The Bane. Gets covered on the Bane. Everybody's out of the roach pit. Tombstone down. The Radiants cannot fight it. But the tear trap's still there. Still have the vision for the Roche. Are they gonna go for it? Uh, wasn't fast enough. Mirana wasn't close enough. Mirana was really far back. Couldn't get there on time for the... For the ages. This TA was really questionable. She was already behind. Still Radiant went for the blink anyway. This blink is useless. She cannot go for the fights right now. She should just get the desolator and uh, then blink. Just go sleep push. She, she never left Radiant's any trap when she was pushing the top. The As a TA player, you need to leave traps on the lane so you can cut waves. You need the Radiant's deep traps like somewhere here. Fallen. You need very deep traps so you can cut the waves. Top tower ain't looking too steady. Hey, I don't even need Dota Plus prediction. I predict yeah. this Dyer's game's win rate for Dire is 100%. <laughs> oh, nice creep onto the Abaddon. Abaddon, just have the OT. Just press the OT and purge off the uh, Bang OT. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. That's a nice 200 gold. Oh, Abana Odi gets cancelled. He doesn't have. Oh, per... took, took the sleep of with a uh, catapult. Oh, he's still gonna. That's a big kill. Killing spree. Double kill. Can they cancel the Jock TV? Nope. Ha, <laughs> caster curse. The Dire actually only have 1k lead. The Jug only has Senjin Yasha. This Avon is very strong now, but uh, his teammates are really behind. They don't really have that much item. And they gave the Aegis to the Viper. They think they should, they need, they should give the Aegis to the Abaddon or... Uh, Abaddon or Jug. Oh, Jug out of position again, but there's nothing to stop the spin. Getting chased by Zombie Moonlight Shadow. Do I have the dust ready? It's only a position, position 5 death, it's okay. Because this Abaddon has a uh, Radiance, but he doesn't have like any uh, HP uh, item or uh, like defensive items. He doesn't have armor. Against TA. Oh, 
down TP. Yeah. Barry just still doesn't have anything to cancel TP. But it doesn't, doesn't matter if they just group up and siege or like force objectives. They don't need to have ways to cancel TPs with Abaddon. They just, bottom tower. They just take down your towers. Good. Force you to fight into them. Oh, Jack is cut again, but not quite enough damage. Wait. I think if he has a tree with two auto attack and the tree toss, Jack dies. Hmm. <laughs> I'm confused. Bottom tower is I think he has Jug Kill there. It's gonna be close, but like. Another mm. attempt trying to toss Jug back. How do you fight into this? Uh, Radiance cannot fight you into the tombstone and uh, Jug Healing. Jug Healing was on cooldown. Mirana! Leapsy very aggressively gets turned down. Can she survive? Mirana dies! What was she doing? Tiny blinks in too, just chain feed. Tiny buys back. Two buy back. I don't think they can defend. Oh, on the outside of the map. He is on the high ground. You can see the spinny push, the red dodo. Oh, Jack Oti goes off. That's a die back for Ogre Still loses the lane. They didn't even get the bottom racks. Radiant's top barracks has fallen. Someone's putting in the legwork. A jug. <laughs> this jug's like. This is ten jug. It's not your normal position Radiant's one jug carry. It's a tank jug. Look at his damage. Ah, it's so painful to watch. Yo, Complex, don't send me a message right now. I'll answer you later. I, I can read. How's Miranda Divine? I, I don't want to trash talk them, man. Oh, Jack, the TP. They have the grip. And TA could have killed the Jack just by right clicking him. There's no Shadow Blade. Oh. I'm gonna heal the creep instead of uh, bursting the tiny, tiny leaves. That, that was gonna be a tiny buyback too, but a dieback too. But uh, the game is pretty much over at this point. I don't see any chance Radiance come back unless I mean even Fountain Dive. Abaddon is pretty good at Fountain Dive, so it's not gonna matter. Radiant's bottom shrine is falling. That's what it gets being so far away. Tiny toss. They find, can they find Vine? They can't even find Venge! The mech and the healing ward kept Venge alive! And the Abaddon heal! Tiny doesn't have a buyback! Radiant structures are fortified. Are they gonna find the guy? Jack's going for it. <laughs> Can I see some uh, blue in the chat? Killing spree. How about I still have his ulti? He just drops him near the other guy. Tia walks around with her BKB. Watching the Lux Rex fall, uh, last Rex fall. Uh, Venge got arrowed, but immediately perched off by the Abaddon. Abaddon is not quite ready for the fountain dive yet. 10 second cooldown on uh, OT. Mm, freshly purchased, I mean, picked up. Uh, you can be from the enemy, enemy farm. Not feeling the love. Are they going to back? I don't think they have to back. They can wipe them one more time. Abaddon has, still has the OT. Huge heal from Abaddon. 
Oh, they do get the vent, but Tiny dies again. They're fighting on top of a tombstone. Zombie apocalypse. Oh, they did. They took down a tombstone, but uh, everybody's dying. The base is dying. The Avatar still have the OT. Uh, Jax finally in with the OT, and he's gonna die again. Who is this job player? Killing spree. This jug got carried so hard. This jug not. Support jug. Support tank jug. It's just a distraction. You think he's a pos position one, but in reality, he's just a distraction. So this real carry Abaddon can shine. That Radiant team's just letting die on their range. Yep, this one's just about all. Hope you didn't bet on these knuckleheads. Uh, GG. From the region. Very entertaining game, guys. Everything new. Uh, like new... Like new stuff every... Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you guys next time. Ta-da! Boy, oh boy. Boy, oh boy. What the heck just happened? Wait, oh, where's all my stuff? Yo, where's my camera? They're all gone. Time for more? Yes, yes. Let's go solo queue. Mm. This Radiant team just lost on draft. Then also the TA play. It's ancient, ancient. Yo, I need to fix my Hobbit. It's not good because every time I start casting, it end up beca becoming me just complaining about their plays. <laughs> oh my god, can't help me. I need to add my camera back. Just give me a second. I don't know, maybe they're like, maybe they're just toying with them, who knows, maybe they're like, they think they're so much better, so they're just toying with them, you can never tell. <laughs> they got boosted. Yo, be nice. It wasn't too bad. They still won the game. The TA is very questionable. I don't know what she was doing. There was no stack. She, uh, no traps in the lanes. Not cutting the wave. I mean, it's pretty unacceptable as a TA player. And the Mirana, very aggressive. But overall, uh, Dyer just have the better draft. It's not a usual draft, but their draft is way better than the uh, Radiant draft. The T did okay during the laning stage, like farming wise. Against, yeah, but uh, after the laning stage, stage they got destroyed.
You know that she leaves? I don't know. I don't know. Their lineup. Ah, uh, their team fight is so weak. They, they, their draft is only good at split pushing and uh, you know fighting picks. They don't have any team fight. Dire side have little bit team fight with uh, Abaddon and I'm dying. The TH you just get a desolator, farm jungle, farm ancients, you know, just all farm the the dire uh the dire team. Force them to split uh deal with her split push. That's how they win. They find picks. Then they uh that's how they win. You know, force them to split, not grouping at five. But this TA just behind the she was behind the whole game. Her network Right now she, like here she, she's farming. Like what happened to the first part of the game? Where the, why was she not farming the jungle? Not farming the ancient. Dude, with bots. Okay, yo, I I need to go to the washroom. Uh, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I put some uh, other people stream. Why are you hang out without me? I'm done. Yo, they hang out without me! Look at this! What's this? Who is this? People tell me who this is. Cancel Dota. Ew, what the That's disgusting, man. <laughs> uh, uh, Complex wanted me to play this. What, what, what? Dude, what is this? I, I need to go to the washroom. I need to go to the washroom. <laughs> you want to see? No, it's not safe to watch. Too much uh, booties. I cannot show that downstream. I, I, I don't get banned. Wait, which one can I watch without getting banned? I can show some of the, some of the streamers, you know, they don't care. Uh, before I go to the washroom. Where's Kriparian? I want to see Kriparian playing uh, Artifact. I hope he doesn't just give up after two days. Let's watch some Shroud, okay? Let's see some uh, crazy plays. I'm going to watch it. No, no, no. I shot the drone. If you get hit by the trap, you can be good. Probably on her. On yellow? Below, Hannah? Mm -hmm. Can you peek me and I'll.
Have the cross. Got hit by my trap. Guys, man, Ash, yeah, Ash yeah. is literally one HP. Oh remaining. my goodness, this guy's literally putting them on their pull. Oh. Ash, yellow. Oh my goodness, that guy literally just oh, he carried those guys so hard, bro. Yeah. Literally so hard. Oh, if he went into my trap too, he would have died. If you hid right there, he would have died. Obviously, you have no way of, obviously you have no way of knowing that, but why does your reflex look like that? It's only on that map. That map, like, causes that reflex to be really, really, like, shitty. <laughs> God, just one fucking dude. That's frustrating. Yep. He baited his team so hard. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> Look at those scores. I know, man. He was literally just carrying his team so hard. He probably had the game of his fucking life right there. If I was to guess. Unfortunately, they were sniping. Of course. Yeah. Oh, is that how they knew I was fucking flanking them, bro? They knew everything, bro. I was literally sneaking up on them. I was sneaking, 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 just like a, a well-timed flank, and then both of them are locked on my fucking eyeballs. you get diamond if you played option. No, I know. It's literally different. It's two different games. In most games, yeah. for me. Like, even Battlefield. Like, literally playing Battlefield off stream is a completely different game. Doesn't matter what the fuck I play. Yeah. Playing hard mode out here. Fucking nuts guy was stream sniping. That's good. Feels good, man. Feels good. I have my chat off, so I can't see any people fucking doing their bullshit. But I think Justin has his chat on, so. Shroud's favorite map. Now, fuck this map. Fuck this map. Milk group. Or milkman group therapy. Think the sub. Ball. Balls, Balsagna? <laughs> okay. Will we get a real game here, folks? Let's find out. Drone has located a bomb. Ten seconds to insertion. Five seconds before insertion. Does anyone know how much e Elo Shroud needs to get diamond? Um, the diffuser has been secured. 120 or something? Found a bomb. I think 120. <laughs> I didn't realize there's a little up top part here. One's to the left in main lobby. He's running into the courtyard. 
Hey, buddy. Mirror's dead. Okay. Uh, one's crouched here. Ready? I'm gonna get this wall up top. So you're running to theater? Down that hallway. Courtyard, I think? <laughs> he was putting his head underneath like the drapes <laughs> and he was oh, like he was uh, like sniffing me because i had my window open he was just thing. sniffing around he put his head under and he was looking at the window sniffing just me hall what vip vip right now I had so many sniffing around, dude. That was funny. I've been losing a few years off my life. <laughs> oh! No, no, pop. Let's go, pop. I go one more pop. I don't really like playing Mirror on this site. I'll play one more pop. I think I'm done for today. I've been live for a long time, right? That's the uh, event organizer, Cindy. Everybody clap. <laughs> I clap. Did 
Ah, this like lo look like a lose to me. Your pick. This is where you win or lose. Ten seconds. Five seconds left. You're dead now. <laughs> Me, but <clears throat> what? Huh? Ten seconds. Five seconds left. Deal with anti mage, or do I have to deal with anti mage? Good Spectre game. Remember, Spectre. the goal is to have fun. <laughs> yeah, who am I kidding? Wait, what's going on? It's over.
Prepare for battle! It's in the bag. That way. Come here, fat. I'll give you tangos too. You want brown. Wow, cool. So you're gonna hold the game hostage for the rest of us because you're upset and being a little fucking child. Congrats. I think even we just let him mid, he would just, you know, die and throw. Doesn't even matter if. You've just achieved first blood. Thanks and have fun. Dominating performance. Hello, this is Gabe Newell. Thanks for playing Dota 2. Double skip. Well, that's that's about it. That's about it. Uh, game over. Bye bye, boys. I see you guys tomorrow. I'll go play Maple Story now. See you tomorrow. Nothing I can do, man. It's over. It's they're just walking down middle ramp. I mean, I can play some Maple Story too.
Yo, are they playing, way? Wait, are they playing? The enemy's attacking your middle tower. Can now be created. What the fuck? And ma Maple Story failed to start. I can't play. Mirana is. Look at Mirana. She just walked down middle feeding. She only she only feed feel four kills. Your middle tower is under attack. Look at her! She just wants to feed! What the fuck? I can't... Can it just end, man? Now, do we still have a chance? Do we still have a chance? Need some help? You gonna do something about it or just sit there looking funny? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm still 5k. Your top tower is under attack. Yo, it's Mirana, and uh, I, I wasn't the one tilting her, okay? The invoker was the one toting her. She's like following me for whatever reason. The top tower is under attack. I want to play Maple Story, but I cannot open Maple Story because this game's running. I can't do anything. What is he doing? Nobody's farming jungle. Why are you even blocking? Are they even talking? Your top tower needs some help. Radiant stretches off for And you know what? Like Uh cause cause it's uh Brew Brood made, right? So like This guy picks Necro to wants to go uh, just go mid Cause we have Invoker against Brood and the Invoker didn't get Tango, he's like not happy, he's gonna grief. And so my support give him two more Tango, he's like, no, I don't want your this Tango, I want the Tango from the Necro. You know? Your top tower is under attack. What the fuck, man? He, he got the Tango, but still not happy, he's like, nah, I want the, I want the Tango from the Necro. 
I don't want the tango from you. <laughs> what the fuck? It's like real five years old. That was fucking crazy, man. Who even says that? Like, what? And this guy first picks Invoker too, man. And you know something is going on. I mean, even we let him mid, he will get destroyed by the by the brood, and he will just feed, you know, by rage buyback and stuff. It's it's gonna happen. I mean, I rather we just lose like this, so we don't have to deal with this shit later. This guy's muted attack. for sure. You know, I'm gonna. We put this Mirana inside the Mirana Walker. Nobody still! Like, but it's the Invoker against Brewmaster, uh, Brew, Brewmother. You're supposed to just, you know, make some changes, Good man. Morning. I hope you're having an amazing day. It's Mark Wiens. I'm in Lahore, Pakistan. And the plan for today, we are driving from Lahore to Gujranwala. It's, it's not a winnable lane. You're gonna get destroyed. We're gonna be taking the GT Man, you Highway, want which to is swap. also called the Grand Trunk Highway, which is a very famous road. And along the way, we're gonna stop at a couple places to eat. But before we leave Lahore today, we have to stop for a breakfast. It's a dish, it's a must. You cannot leave Lahore without trying this dish. So we're gonna have breakfast first, and then we are on our way to Gujranwala. <laughs> Just arrived at a restaurant. It's called Wadi's Nihari. It's a stew. It's it's. I've had it before. It's incredibly delicious. We have a few different versions. The one with brain as well, and then one with uh, meat. He takes a piece brain? of meat. Um, then he grabs some of the actual stew, which is like a nutty color. Anybody been to Pakistan here? Um, have you guys been to Pakistan? Into the meat and take some of the oil and pour some of the red oil on top to finish it off. <laughs> He heated up a whole pan full of desi ghee and with, with, with infused it with some ginger until that came to a boil. Then he poured over a few spoons onto the top of the nihari, um, and then he heated each bowl of nihari over the open flame as well. That's just finishing it off. Okay, it's ready to go eat. We got a couple of different versions. One is just with the beef, one is with the beef and the brains. Um, it comes with the fresh tandoori roti, and then you always have to season with ginger, chilies, and lime. And then we also got those lassis as well. Yeah, this is beautiful. I'm so excited for this right now. <laughs> that meat is so tender. You can just you can just run a piece of bread over it, and it starts to like tear apart. And some of that sauce without seasoning it. Oh wow! And all of that desi ghee. Dude, are you kidding? Season with. We got a couple of different versions. One is just with the beef, one is with the beef and the brains. Um, it comes with the fresh tandoori roti, and then you always have to season with ginger, chilies, and lime. And then we also got those lassis as well. Yeah. Dude, this low, yeah. this is beautiful. I'm so excited for this right now. <laughs> that meat is so tender. You can just you can just run a piece of bread over it, and it starts to like tear apart. And some of that sauce without seasoning it oh, oh wow and all of that desi ghee dude are you kidding you don't eat beef why <laughs> wow why is it like i love you so much oh, so good yeah. <laughs> thank you one more bite so good one more bite. We will take another bite. Okay, meat is so tender. 
then you've got like the creamy like stew of the Nihari underneath it. Very fragrant, very infused desi ghee. Yeah, it's awesome. Ah. But it does need to be seasoned oh, with the ginger and the yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and lime. Yeah, right? Making sure to grab some of the chilies yeah. and that meat. Oh, that meat just <laughs> flakes apart. <laughs> oh, the drip. That meat, that meat is insanely tender. You actually don't need teeth to chew it. Then with that ginger, with those thin slices of chilies to get bump up the heat. This one includes the same beef, but then also brain. Huh? Oh, okay. It just sort but of the like same religion, sunk. right? Similar just religion. Like collapse into the desi ghee, and they, they become one with the desi ghee when you try to pick it up. <laughs> the desi ghee just like. Gives it the the lubrication factor. Then you've got the the meat, which is so unbelievably tender. Then you've got the brains, which just sort of like slide right in there, like hard boiled. He's asking you. You had some chili. Oh, brain, brain. This is brain. You eat brain. Can't squeeze that brain is okay. It's not too bad. Touch. You can have a little bit, but like you don't eat the whole brain because it's gonna be like too rich. I've had Among the richest dishes I think I've ever had in my life. This one is the Nali Nihari, and this one is actually the most famous version with marrow inside. So those little white nuggets are all marrow chunks. <laughs> Not India? That probably is the best. <laughs> I think that's, that, that means it's from India. Is, again, it's just like disintegrating into the desi ghee, plus the meat, plus the ginger. This is like ultimate meatiness. And after that bite, I need to lean back and sip on the lassi. Pull the milk mustache. <laughs> Tastes kind of like melted ice cream. So Nihari is not a dish I could eat too frequently because there's <laughs> so much desi ghee. It's what? so heavy. But like what it's other so country rich. don't eat but that cows? Was, uh, it was but a like, treat. from my what knowledge, only India day. doesn't eat cow. On our way heading towards, in the direction towards Gujranwala and we're taking the GT road which is uh, the that's the abbreviation for the Grand Trunk Road which connects Central Asia to South Asia so it runs all the way from Kabul in Afghanistan to Chittagong in Bangladesh uh, passing through northern Pakistan there's lots of traffic and people take this road going short distances from town to town this is a very significant road and we are traveling it today like an hour and a half drive we didn't actually end up stopping along the way but we made it to the city this is where we're gonna do some more eating and walk around and explore for the day for most of the day and behind me right here this is the watchtower built by the British we just walked down the street a little bit and we're gonna stop somewhere to eat a massive like some massive production of friedness mainly what they're serving is pakoras which are little fried fritters there's potato in it there's some vegetables there's herbs there's spices um, the cauldron of oil is bubbling away but they do have like an entire I think they have a few different What's versions this? but we're gonna get a plate of the pakoras freshly fried uh, he just grabs like fistfuls of the batter mixture potato just like squeezes it into the oil and then just like when they're done frying, <laughs> you just fish you just fishes it out That's we gotta try some of the hot India. fresh pakoras oh nice thank you you take a chunk you dip it into that little i think it's a yogurt sauce oh Oh, it's hot. Yeah, that's great. That's freshly fried. Um, there's potato in there. The, the, the green is actually spinach. It does have a little bit of spiciness to oh, a a dream deep fried snack. Ali said we need to try it with roti. It's actually common. I, never, I didn't know it was a thing ever to eat pakora with roti. Yeah, it does kind of work because you got the soft fluffy roti and then the really crispy 
pakora, the textures. It's a textures thing. That's oh, nice. Yeah, it's really nice. That's my comfort snack at home. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you. Very good. So, Good Janwala is known for their food and also known for their wrestlers for having big guys that wrestle. So, we have a surprise. I had no. I'll knock them out like. You know? Ease. idea we were gonna have we were gonna Destroy. have this opportunity uh, but we met up with one of Ali's friends um, who has arranged for us to see some of the local traditional wrestling and uh, that's where we're on our way to next <laughs> quite the oh, forklift quite the bustling area and we're gonna go oh I forgot to mention that the, the wrestling doesn't start for about 15 or 20 minutes so we have we're gonna stop quickly to eat something before we go to the wrestling wait my girlfriend streaming what uh kiba kiba My girlfriend. What? <laughs> <laughs> He's <so> top. <laughs> it's supper. Pizza. I'll eat forever. Okay, I'm down streaming, boys. I'll stream tomorrow. I've streamed so long today. I stream like fucking how long? Eight hours? Ten hours? I think ten hours. What are you doing here? Go away. Uh, just search. Uh, I'll, I'll post it here, okay? Let's go to my girlfriend's channel and uh, mess with oh, her. Oh, what am I doing? I don't even know what I'm doing. Give her a follow. Why did you link me? Where are you going? Be 